Hey guys, welcome back to STV. So today I'm gonna teach you how you can make your own audio book with just 10 or 12 lines of code in Python. Less than 10 or 12 lines of code, you can make your own audio book for free and in Python very easily. You can convert any book into a audio book in your PC. Compulsory we should have a PC guys. So what we have to do is now I am going to use today in our course Python. Today I am going to use Python guys and we should have an editor that named PyCharm. So what we have to do is to download Python just click here python.org. I will leave a link in description so you can download from there. See here in downloads you can download this file. I will leave a link. So I'm using PyCharm. To download PyCharm, just click PyCharm. So just click on PyCharm. Yes, this is, you can see here, right? This is download PyCharm. I will link of this. I will leave link of this also in description below. So you can download from there. So we need PyCharm and Python. So now after downloading it, what we have to do is, so guys, you can see here, right? Here I have already saved my code. Yesterday I have done a small code and already I have saved my code here. Now what we have to do is, here we can see our PyCharm. Open the PyCharm. It takes some time to open. Yeah, it takes some time. Yeah, see this is I have done. And what we have to do is click on file and new project and i will name it as audio book one why because yesterday i have done an audio book one yeah new window yeah so guys it says creating virtual environment it will create our virtual environment for some time it just creates virtual environment for some time you can skip some video you can skip some why because it's it's just installing creating virtual environment so it takes lots of time like one minute or anything yo yes guys we got our virtual environment one so here you can see right this is a sample script of python just control a and backspace so we need in this two packages for making this project the first package is just go to terminal and then you have to type there pip install py python text to speech x3 so py tts x3 and click on install so we need to install pip install py tts x3 yeah it just is still installing. Wait, say, wait for some time. It installs our PYTT SX3. Yeah, it just installed. And we need another package that named PY and capital PDF and two. Another package named PY PDF two. Oh, sorry, pip install py capital pdf2 just click on enter yeah it successfully installed our two packages so now what we have to do is we have to close this panel and what we're going to click here is i will leave source code in the description yesterday already i have in source code so you can see here right this is our source code so this is our source code right this is our source code so what we have to do is just copy the source code i will leave description i will leave source code in description so you can copy it and paste in your python otherwise i will link i will leave a link in description okay so now what we have to do is paste the code here so yeah we got our code so now what we have to do is to we want the audiobook so what we have to do is i will just download the object oriented python program pdf Okay. I got my 
object oriented python pdf so what i'm going to do is i'll just download it so i'll save it in <coughs> sorry do so what i want to do is i'll save that in so here you can see that c users family pc python products right so i'll just open it c users family pc python projects audio book 1 and i will paste it here yeah guys i just installed it in the this file and see here yeah we got our pdf form so you can convert any pdf into an audio book like any stories like a books anything uh, but i only know that it will just audio book in just english not telugu or english telugu or hindi sorry so here we have installed so let's run the code no 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 not run the code here you can see some like example o o o p dot p def right just backspace that remove it and what we have what we have to type there is here you can see the name right i'll just type op jet so c i'll got my pdf name there i'll just click on enter Hey guys, got it. So let's run and we'll check will it work or not. O P M Python two object oriented means directed towards yeah. objects. Success guys. In other words, it means functionally directed towards modeling objects. This is one of the many techniques used for modeling complex systems by describing a collection of interacting objects via their data and behavior. Python. So you saw guys right so our father product project is success so i converted a pdf file into audio book that it reads this text out and so if you want to if you want to make same project like this the source code will be in description and if this video is helpful please like share subscribe you can't comment why because our comment is in books mode if you want to ask me any questions you can ask me comments in you can ask me questions from my comments in i'll paste a video link in description from there you can ask me comments so guys so our project is success so when we have made a audio book okay so tomorrow i'll come with tomorrow i'll come again with the interesting python project so till the time stay tuned for more videos thank you please like share and subscribe source code will be in description python download in description and pycharm download in description if you don't understand please watch the video again please like please share please subscribe and don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to activate the bell icon thank you stay tuned for more updates thank